we would have chosen a different route for Jeremy. I mean, Sophia, for me, I would have wanted a boy who I can go and play golf with. Yeah. I would have wanted a boy that I can do things with, you know, uh, uh, play football with him and so forth. We are not able to do that, and that's fine. What I know is that there's a plan that God has for that boy. Mm. And to answer your question, I reconcile it by knowing that God is sovereign. Mm -hmm. He's sovereign. He's king of everything. I may want things to be done my way, but my way may not be God's way. Mm -hmm. So I must get to a place where I surrender Jeremy to God, surrender everything to him and tell him, God, whatever it is that you're doing with this boy, yeah. you do it. Yeah. At your own time, because I know he's going to be a prophet. I know he's going to be a man of God. At your own time, you're going to bring, make all things work together for his good. Wow. Because God does, do, uh, God does that. Yeah. He will make all things work together for his good. And one day, Jeremy will be a great testimony. In fact, right now, mm. he's a great testimony. He has encouraged many. Um, when he went to his school, he's in a new school now, and they were talking to him and asking him a few questions about his condition. He said, guys, do you know it could be worse? Mm. The teachers called us in and they were, they were crying. They said, Jeremy was telling us it could be worse. Wow. I could actually be in a position where I'm not talking, I'm not hearing, I have many problems. Mm -hmm. He said, it could be worse. And Jeremy was telling them, I look at myself to be so fortunate and so blessed wow. that I can be able to walk, to walk with my walker that I can be able to eat and I can be able to be okay. I am not sitting here pouring saliva on myself. Mm. He said, I always look at the glass half, half a full. Looking at not the better at the, side. Yes, yeah. not as half empty. And so he's been an encouragement because sometimes, Sophia, it is not our victories that encourage people. Mm. It is the how we fought through challenges and overcame that, uh, that encourage people. So yeah. I know that one day Jeremy will stand and preach to people who probably have gone even through worse than he has gone through. And because he can relate to them, mm. and because there is a way that he can minister to them that nobody else can, he'll be able to touch their lives yeah. like nobody can.